Big title. championship you talk about Alex Hammerstone you talk about Jacob Fatu both guys represented the company so well but has anybody ever dominated as much as Alex Kane has anybody ever gotten as many wins as the charisma the crowd the fans the entourage there is no one quite like Alex Kane and there has not been a title run quite like this one Alex Kane the MLW world champion defends it tonight against Kojima Let's go to Rich Palladino for their introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, your Super Fight main event is set for one fall with a 60 minute time limit and it is for the MLW World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing first the challenger to my left, Accompanied to ringside by Shigeo Okamura. <laughs> Hailing from Kotoku, Tokyo, Japan. Weighing in at 238 pounds, Satoshi Kojima. And his opponent, directly in front of me, is accompanied to ringside by Mr. Thomas. And he represents the captain of the Bumaye Fight Club, hailing from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 240 pounds. He is the current reigning and defending MLW World Heavyweight Champion, the Suplex Assassin, Alex Kane. Kane has been synonymous with that championship for many months now, that world title a source of strength but this is the title fight Satoshi Kojima has wanted since he was defeated by the late great Mike Awesome 21 years ago. And let's be honest, Christian, the odds are not in Kojima's favor historically. You look throughout the world champions in the history of the sport and men who went 22 years between reigns of the same championship. I mean, I think we're talking, what? Luthez era, the last yeah. time that happened, that's not something you see in no, this sport. it isn't, but it's going to be a tall task for Kojima, as again I mentioned earlier, Bumaye Alex Kane, our world champion, a dominant one, a man who doesn't lose often, if at all, and 
And you got to think that Kojima's got probably his biggest test for a championship in his historic career tonight. And, and you know, we have watched Alex Kane grow up before our eyes, and we've seen him learn and grow with every successful title defense. No one has choked out more men into successful title defenses than Alex Kane all time. And, but can you choke out, can you tap out Satoshi Kojima, who's back to his feet so quickly? Yep. Blue Cats game so far. I believe. Even match. I believe Kojima was the first man to ever capture all three major championships in Japanese wrestling. The IWGP Triple Crown, the GHC Championship. He's a multiple-time IWGP Tag Champion, never openweight uh, trios champion. Kojima is so decorated. And if he's successful here tonight, he will be the ultimate breadwinner, to say it the least. A story that's tied to MLW. Our very foundation was built on the back of Kojima flying to Japan and defending against Shinjiro Otami and Mr. Ganusuke and John Tenta and Vampiro and coming back a heralded hero, Johnny Smith. Everybody that, that uh, uh, Satoshi Kojima has overcome built that legacy a little bit built bigger and now Alex Kane, could he take that to a new frontier entirely by adding a fourth former world champion to a successful defense list? Humaye, of course, Alex Kane wearing the gold and black, befitting a champion. And this crowd in Philly, this sold out crowd here at the historic 2300 Arena in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, they, they're here for this. This is the main event. I mean, this is for all the marbles, the world championship on the line, and I don't think Alex Kane's gonna let it go so easy. Well, Kane, there's been so much money, so much time. I mean, Don King's name is tied to the likes of Muhammad Ali and Iron Mike Tyson. Don King doesn't represent an average athlete. Alex Kane on top, two count and almost a count of three. That early, if Don you. He sees a generational talent in you. He sees somebody that will stand the test of time forever. Alex Kane thus far has been that athlete, but will that legacy ride past Super Fight? You can see Kane now attacking the right arm of Kojima. Really putting the work on there. Big elbow drop. And this is the psychology and the smarts of Alex Kane. He's able to isolate a limb, attack it, and try to break down the body of Kojima, the older opponent. A lot of that expertise comes from chief fight strategist, Mr. Thomas, on the outside, back left of the screen with Faye Jackson. Alex Kane has been so diligent, so focused, Every waking moment of his life is about being a better athlete and being that world champion. Alex Kane's championship run has been nothing short of amazing. He's defeated a franchise, yep. a werewolf, and a top draft pick. But now, a legend amongst legends stares him in the face as Kane looks to chop him down the sides. A cocky cover there. Yeah, actually unexpected from Alex Kane there. I think just trying to maybe play some mind games with Kojima, trying to show Not him, so. you know, I got this. I mean, everybody heralds Kojima with such respect, and justifiably so. Kane, we're going to take that away, but Kojima fires back. The man that beat Filthy Tom Lawler in his first matchup in MLW in over two decades. Beat Sammy Callahan at reload a couple of weeks ago. Can Kojima keep his unbeaten streak in the modern era of MLW alive. Kane trying to answer with those chops to the chest of Kojima. Another thing to, to bring up the, the odds being against Kojima, no one in MLW history has ever won the world title two times. Kojima looking to defy that stat as he rapid fires chops to the chest cavity. Oh, that glazed over look in the eyes of Alex Kane shows you the damage that's been done. 
Big flying forearm by Kojima. And that's where you see that strong style attack. The crowd are up to that chant of bread. Kojima's favorite food. Motivates him on. Fans throwing bread in the ring when he beat Lawler back in New York City. Alex Kane feeling the effects of those chops. Fires away. A discus forearm. Drops the DDT. Kane, that far away look in his eye, continues to persist as Kojima to his feet. A weight on his shoulders. And as my partner alluded to earlier, Kojima, of course, the first MLW champion over two decades ago. How brilliant is it to be able to see him here still competing for a championship? And frankly, he looks great. Alex Kane, oh, snapped up a suplex, Saido style. That's tough, though. You can't take a Saido suplex on the back of your neck like that and be expected to come back in this match. That is a devastating move by Alex Kane. Kane has over 100 suplexes in his arsenal. But uh, to our point, everything that Major League Wrestling has been built into is on the foundation of what Satoshi Kojima represents. It was launched on that title reign. It became a worldwide superpower on that title reign. Kojima would love to take it to even new heights, but Alex Kane has his own direction in mind, and when Kane gets aggressive and gets focused, there may be no man better in the major league. Shoulders down, Kane on top, but Kojima kicks out. It's a tough match for Kojima. You know, his daughter was in the hospital recently. He actually had to fly to America to attempt to get this world title, all while that was on his mind. And Alex Kane, it, it's got to be tough on him. Without question, if you have a lapse in concentration or judgment, Alex Kane is good enough to capitalize. And look at Kane, standing straight up, all the leverage, has the ankle of Kojima. You can see on the gear of Alex Kane that Bumaye slogan. Bumaye is not just a slogan, Joe, though. It is a lifestyle, it is a culture. It is something the fans have been able to get behind here in the major leagues. Going for an overhead exploder throw. Kojima gets the elbow. Look at her. Oh, cozy cutter! That was a nasty cutter, Joe, and it was in a perfect spot. Right in the center of the ring. Kojima looking to gather his wits and potentially maybe go for a cover here as Mr. Thomas looks on. Kojima looks in a bad way, but the elbow pad is off. The lariat has been so devastating, and all oh, Kane ducked underneath and found that exploder. Kane, out of nowhere, somehow gets that exploder suplex. He hooks the outside oh leg. God. Had the leverage, had the weight, unable to get three. And that's what, two suplexes thus far? There's at least 98 more, and Kane specializes in each and every one of them. You look at Kane now, grabbing a hold of the tights. Just trying to get Kojima in a better position to attack the lower back. If we see another suplex here, Joe, we will. German release style. And the brutality of the suplex is bad enough, but Kojima landing in the ropes, and that's only going to make that, that impact more unforgiving. I'm not sure we've ever seen a more powerful champion here in Major League Wrestling. And look at this. Oh! Just have you seen a suplex like that? That's the first time you see, I've seen something like that. I mean, two count there, Done. Joe. Oh. My God. He just picked him up, was about to be a standing suplex, and then just throwing him forward. I, did Kane just say to Thomas, what do I got to do? I'd be asking the same thing. Thomas trying to coach him. You know, he's a, he's a strategist. He's the mastermind behind Kane's offense. That tells me, though, that Kane is taken aback by some of the defense and some of the resolve of Kojima. Does Kojima have that fighting spirit with everything on his mind, with, with what's happened, personal issues as a father, as, as a family man, and a cover here, This will do it! No! Oh, Kane hit a variation of that Kane maker. And maybe that just answered my question. I mean, even with everything on his mind, with everything stacked against Kojima, still able to kick out, still able to fight. 
is that family issue, renting space in Kojima's head, or is it inspiring him? We may never know. Fighting for his daughter, for his family, for the legacy, for everything that Kojima holds dear. Oh, Lariato from a standing position. Did he get enough? He certainly got a lot of it. Oddly enough, not going for the cover. He seems to think he needs to do more damage here. And a little bit of Alex Kane's medicine getting given to him. Beautiful suplex. Goes in for the cover. Oh. And only one. Kojima, half a suplex, half a brain buster. But Kane to his feet at one. And now, with the full torque, Lariato! Nasty Lariat. Kojima, the cover! Will history oh, be the man Oh my God, he has done it! Here is your winner, the f and...